All right, so here we are, Doom Eternal. We have finished the campaign, and now we'll be hopping into the DLC. There are two story DLCs I'll be doing, the Ancient Gods Part 1 and the Ancient Gods Part 2. I looked at the review, I, I noticed that on the Steam page for it, the reviews were uh, mixed, which was interesting. So <laughs> I looked and I read some. I didn't get any spoilers or anything. Anyway, what I did gleam, glean from the uh, reviews that the DLC is really, really difficult. <laughs> and that uh, most people had a lot of issues just playing it on normal difficulty. So instead of Nightmare, I think I'll just be playing on Ultra Violence this time around. Uh, it'll still give me a challenge, but also I want to get through this. Yeah, I want to have some uh, a bit more fun with this. It seems that Nightmare is just... Uh, people said they really didn't enjoy their time with that on the Ancient Gods Part 1. So yeah, I'll just be sticking with uh, Ultra Violence, see how that goes. You know, if it does end up being too easy, I'll hop up the difficulty. But we'll see how that goes. The Ancient Gods 1. But more demons because it's DLC. There it is at the bottom. They had to add a note, I guess, because it's pretty difficult. So... Uh, yeah, I'll just be doing Ultra Violence for this run. Quick reflexes in combat and exploration throughout the levels are the keys to success in Doom Eternal. If you're an experienced FPS player with great reflexes and you love exploring levels of, for progression items, then this difficulty setting is for you. Uh, enemies throw power attacks more often and deal significant damage. Death may be com uh, common early on as you learn to master the skills needed to dominate the combat experience. <laughs> now nah, I'll just do Ultra Violence. I've seen their views. People said it's not fun on Nightmare, so... I'll just go into the ultra violence. Previously in Doom Eternal, the forces of Hell had descended on Earth, and the Doom Slayer returned in defense of mankind. The Hell Priests were cast down, and the Slayer carried his vengeance to he the heavens themselves to end the demonic evasion. There he challenged the Maker's Angels of Deceit and defeated the ancient Khan who had led them astray. The conquest of Earth had been halted, but now a new threat has risen. The demons that remain in Erdak have corrupted the once holy realm and threatened to use the higher dimension as a new pathway for conquests. If they are not banished, all of existence is at risk. To stop them, the Slayer must now journey to find the Seraphim, a mysterious figure from his past whose whereabouts until now have remained unknown. Only he can guide the Slayer to the one being capable to the one being capable of sealing Erdak back off from the demons once again. I knew it was here. Sir! Weather's disrupting the signal, but we'll be able to teleport him onto the rig's main deck. Uh, Dr. Hayden, ready to launch the package, sir. Whenever you're ready. Alright, we, we got more people. Control of Erdak without the Seraphim's help. You broke the seal when you awakened the Icon of Sin in their world. The balance between their two dimensions has been broken with the demons now in control of Erdak. Portal ready in three, two... The Ancient Gods Part 1, Doom Eternal, title card. I'm ready. Hmm, I feel like this glitched out. Oh, never mind. The death of yeah. the con maker was a necessary step in saving Earth from the demons. But it came at a price. Alright. Yeah, that was kind of uh, funky right there. <laughs> it spawned, it was showed them without the uh, actual uh, oil rig or whatever. Alright. Hopefully, uh, I am still audible over the storm. Let's see, ammo wise. We are full, I think. We sure are. Let's see if I have the other thing. I sure do. All right. Onward. The UAC won't hand over the Seraphim without a fight. All right. I feel like it's a little faster than before. Oh. Boom. 
he's gone. It's feeling a little easier on ultra violence. I missed. Oh, I almost did. <laughs> All right. Where are you, buddy? Oh. And he's gone. Oh. Hmm. Awesome. Speed is a lot uh, higher. And that might just be me. Blue access required. See, nothing. And we have secrets still. We do. All right, more runes too. I wonder what uh, new ones we got, or if I have any. I do. I have my old runes. All right, carrying over everything. All right. <laughs> Probably maybe going that way. Yes, we are. Let me check above deck first. Nope, just locked as well. Two shots for that. Do I have the increased movement speed rune on or something? Perform glory kills faster. Launch to a glory kill from further away. And gain a speed boost after performing a glory kill. I don't want those. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. This third one will do. It's 5 1 death blow. Launch to a glory kill from further away. I'll keep. Perform glory kills faster. I'll switch out for. Um, let's see, the equipment one. Uh, there we go. All right. <laughs> All right. So we got this, that, and then this, and I think we are all set. Speed boost was a uh, kind of messed me up. <laughs> I was like, oh. rockets I don't need, doors that are locked. I don't like that. What is that? Full health and armor. Ooh, key card. And yet another locked door. I might have to...
Going pretty well. I don't know how I missed all the shots. <laughs> oh, cag demons. Oh. Ouch. All right, I'm going to die. Don't like that. Using my other cash on this, the better one. Oh. Come on. oh, and I am up. All right. And he's gone. Of course. He had to take that shot from. Ouch. Where did you come from? <sighs> Ouch. All right. Who's next? I think that's everyone. Oh, I want to grab that health. <laughs> Got it. Now we can head up. They want me to go the other way. Oh, actually, I'm gonna go for that, uh, secret down below. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> oh, he's down. Died. I still died. <laughs> no. I got stuck on the railing. Shots. Oh, another one. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. And there we go. Oops. Accidentally went to the BFG. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> that would have been bad. Let's see. We'll put this on to uh, this. better, I guess. <laughs> um, actually, see that, and then this. Uh, why is this so confusing? I hate that. All right, so this, and now this, and now, there we go. <laughs> All right, door unlocked.
where was that secret? I think it's one layer above. So I'm gonna go get that first before I, <laughs> I deal with any of this. Take that health. Oh, we got some lore. Let's see. Book of the Seraphs. Mm -mm -mm. It is written by the Seraphs that when the void first appeared, the father alone swept across it. New realities bloomed where he lingered, and when he stopped the rest, Erdak sprung forth from him. Here, the father experimented until he created Jakad, a realm superior to Erdak. The father gifted Jakad's denizens with burning ambition, and he suppressed restraint so that indecisiveness could not wait. And he suppressed restraint so that indecisiveness could not curb their efforts. In the same moment he brought forth Jakad, the father forged Davoth to steward the realm. Davoth was a prime, a prime evil, one of the father's first gods, and uh, of such strength that each realm could contain only one. Alone, Jakad's minds achieved great marvels as they sought to create a paradise. They grasped for unimagined powers to create a perfect society. Davoth felt pride as his people aspired to greatness but found their mortality to be a curse, an ending he would never be subjected to. Eventually, their love of life and unbridled curiosity led them to seek immortality itself, as even Davoth feared his people's end while he alone remained. Davoth bent all Jakad to, seek, uh, to seeking this ultimate knowledge at any cost. As the father planned his next realm, he saw that Davoth was uh, would never cease his research for everlasting life for his people, no matter the cost, as he had been created by the father to care deeply for Jakad and its children. Foreseeing that Davoth's rule would ultimately grow to threaten all creation, and that Davoth would someday rise to, the ch to challenge the father himself, the creator of all things sealed Jakad off from the myriad dimensions and folded in his arms. Davoth bent all Jakad utterly to his will, consumed with fury at their abandonment, until outside the gleaming walls of Emora, the plundered lands festered. The clear-watered pleasure lake spoiled into the blood swamps. The palace of groans grew over the Ardenite gardens. The father watched as Jakad fell into darkness and knew it could never happen again. Determined to avoid a similar result for the earthly realm, the father blessed his new ex newest experiment with mortal pains and misfortunes so that his new creations would treasure life, empathy, and peace. Oh, interesting. Um, where am I? Oh, hey, this door's open now. <laughs> Secret obtained. And we're also still on the correct path. Doo -doo -doo. Got him. <laughs> Let's see. Mm -mm -mm. So we gotta jump across. And I got everything over here. Let's do it. Hey. There we go there. Oh. And oh. Uh, he took one more punch than I thought he would. Oh. There we go there. Weak point turrets. Ooh. All right, new enemy. The turret is a ranged ambient demon. Oh, interesting. <laughs> Stood uh stand too close or have its reticle linger on you for too long and it hides. Wait, what? Or have your reticle linger on it for too long and it hides. The eyes at weak point, shoot it to deal massive damage. Explode a co- oh, alright, cool. Oh. Seems they prefer this for that, so I'll uh, keep on this. There's red access, alright. Oh. Alright, that was a uh, not one hit. Now it is. Alright. Here we go. <laughs> All right. Well, that is also a locked door. Ouch. What? Where did you come from? 
Right, not in time. <laughs> Thank you. Ouch, on fire. Random environmental fire. <laughs> Who's shooting? Who's shooting a whole lot? Oh, again, dude. All right. For some reason, I didn't realize that I was not connected to the right enemy with that. See what to go in with. This is all fine to start with. Oh, come on. All right, there we go. Oh. Didn't even realize. Oh, missed. That was a terrible quick. Oh, alright. Come on, buddy. Thank you. Come on, quick scope. There we go. Ooh, I didn't even notice. I don't think I got this one last time, to be honest. There we go. Oh, oh my god, I didn't realize there's another one right there. Oh, 
All right. Oh. Come on. I don't want to die again. Where is someone? There's another turret, I just realized. You can save me. No, his head saved it. I missed. I see a power up that will certainly come in handy right about. Nope, can't get it. <laughs> Alright. No, alright. I see how to get it though. I'm gonna go for it! No, that was a bad idea. <laughs> I think I'll focus. I'll try this on the turret and see if that makes it a little easier. Oh. Sure does. survived two shots there, but it is what it is. I think I missed, to be honest. Oh, what's this other one? There it is. Got it. I think that's uh, everything. Oh, hey, buddy. Um... There you go. Ooh, uh, big guy. Big guy and shield guy. Thank you for that. Oh. And he's gone. Hmm. All right. Oh. Stuff's hurting. A lot of stuff is hurting. I need to go. Where's that pole? There it is. Ouch. I missed. Oh, no, I didn't. I actually didn't get it. Ouch, come on, please. I don't know why I can't hit that, but I honestly, I think I, <laughs> I need to if I'm going to survive this. Let's just not die. Now we shall try again. And this time... Uh, I don't know. This time we'll hit it. I missed again. Come on. Now where are you? I don't know what beat me up in that corner, but something sure did. Let's see, let's focus on getting some armor. Oh, I hate you guys. Got him. Oh, 
Thank you. And... Thank you. I think it's just regular enemies. Not oh, one more shield, yeah. Ammo acquired. <laughs> Who's next? Oh, I hear him. There you are. 